Hello my dear friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Myself, I am Logos Jogi. I have completed MSc in Agriculture, Seed Science and Technology, Specialization Seed Science and Technology from HNB US Central University, Srinagar, Uttarakhand in 2020. I have got 52 rank in PhD program, Seed Science and Technology from Indian Council of Agriculture Research, ICR, All India Entrance Examination for Admission in 2021. Today I am going to tell about the topic seed production of coal vegetables cabbage climatic requirements cabbage thrips is a relatively cool moist climate with moderate to heavy rainfall well distributed during the growing seasons it can withstand frost in the heat stage but otherwise freezing temperature or destructive if require a dormant period of cool temperature to bolt and initiate seed stalks and flowers cool temperature however are effective only after stem diameter is one centimeter at least in temperate climate this occurs during the winter after the first season growth Flowering and seed production follow in the second year. Heated plants from seed stalks when exposed to mean temperature of about 5 degrees Celsius for 6 to 8 weeks. As little as 2 weeks of such temperature subsists with immature plants. In India, seed production of cabbage is possible only in hill areas. Land and isolation requirements same as described for cauliflower. Methods of seed production Being a venial, the cabbage required to season to produce seeds in the first season, the heads are produced and in the following season seed production follows. The seed crop can be in left in set two or transplanted during atoms. In setu method is usually followed by certified seed production and the latter for nucleus seed production. In the in setu methods, the crop is allowed to overwinter and produce seed in their original positions. That is the where where they are first planted in the seedling stage. In the transplanting method, the mature plants are uprooted, uprooted. after removing walls, the plants are immediately rest in a well prepared new fields in such a way that the whole stem below the heads goes underground with the head resting just above the surface. Three methods have been devised to produce seed of cabbage stem method in this method when the crop in the first season is fully mature the heads are examined for trinus two types the plants with off type heads are removed when heads are cut just below the base of means of a sharp knife keeping the stem with outer or of leaves intact the beheaded portion of the plant is called stem the heads are marketed and the stem either are left in situ or replanted in the second season during autumn the following spring after the dormancy is broken the buds sprout from the axils of all the leaves and leaf scars Advantage 1. Give extra income by way of sale of heads. 2. The crop matures 12 to 15 days yearly, then the heads intact method. 3. Seed yield is a slightly increased disadvantage. In this method, flowering suit are decumbent and require very heavy staking. Otherwise, they break down very easily while 
interculturing or spraying stem with central core in a intact method in this method when the crop is fully mature in the first season the heads are examined for drainage to type plants with off type heads are removed and rejected then the heads are chopped on all sides with downward perpendicular cuts in such a way that the central core is not damaged this is the improvement our stem method in that the shoots rising from the main stem are no documents during the last week of february and up till 15 march when the heads starting bursting two vertical cross cut are given to the heads taking care that the central growing point is not injured in the absence of such cuts the heads burst out in regularly and sometimes to growing tip is broken the operation is completed by going around the field tips or thrips during the period advantage one shoot rising rising from the main stem are not decumbent hence very heavy stacking is not required to seed yield is increased disadvantage one the chopped head cannot be marketed head in intact method in this method when the crop is fully mature in the first season the heads are examined for trunus to type the plants with off type heads are removed from the field the head c is kept in intact and only a cross cut is given a facilitate the emergence of stalk advantage one the remove of heads stem method are chopping of heads on all sides central core intact method is not required this is save time to labor time and labor to very heavy stacking is not required disadvantage one the seed yield is slightly low as compared to stem or stem with central core intact method brief culture practices in setu methods one time of sowing and transplanting the sowing time of different varieties should be so adjusted as to complete heads for mention by the end of october or first week of november by which time to mean temperature falls to 10 degree celsius or below at this temperature the heads stand best for over wintering yearly varieties like golden acre should be sown from 10th to, to 25th july and transplanted when the seedlings are 3 to 4 weeks old during the second fortnight of august this sowing time must be strictly adhered to as the crop from a yearly sowings have matured heads during september and starts prewinter boosting and bolting it is thus level to be much affected by frost and snow during winter moreover due to high main temperatures of september 20 degree celsius the heads get infected with bacterial stock rot which sometime is very severe the late crop planted during september does not form heads and bolt directly during spring and the seed grower is not able to ascertain purity of the crop medium late varieties like 
ڈروفی شور ہیڈس اینڈ لیٹ ویرائٹیز لائک ڈرم ہیڈس وچ ٹیک اباؤٹ ٹو ٹو تھری منتھس ٹو پروڈیوس میچور ہیڈس شوڈ بی ساؤنڈ ڈیورنگ دا سیکنڈس اینڈ فاسٹ فور نائٹ آف جون ریسپیکٹلی اینڈ ٹرانسپلانٹنگ فنسڈ وائی دا فاسٹ ویک آف اگست دا مینس ٹیمپریچرس ٹوینٹی ٹو پوائنٹ فائیو ڈگری سیلسیس ٹو ٹوینٹی ڈگری سیلسیس اینڈ فورٹین ڈگری سیلسیس آف اگست سپٹمبر اینڈ اکٹوبر ریسپیکٹلی افورڈ آپٹیمم ریکوائرمنٹس فار گروتھ اینڈ ہیڈس فارمیشن دا لیٹ ٹرانسپلانٹڈ کراپ اسٹارٹس ہیڈس فارمیشن ڈیورنگ اسپرنگ اینڈ کنٹینیوس اپ ٹو جون اینڈ یوزلی ڈز ناٹ پروڈیوس سیڈ اسٹارٹس ٹو میتھڈ آف سوونگ نرسری دا سیڈس آر سوونگ از رائزڈ نرسری بیڈس ان اے مینر سملر ٹو دیٹ آف کول فلاور تھری سورس آف سیڈ اینڈ سیڈ ریٹ آپٹ اینڈ نیوکلیس آر ویڈس آر فاؤنڈیشن سیڈ فرام سورس اپروڈ بائی اے سیڈ سرٹیفکیشن ایجنسی مین سیزن اینڈ لیٹ ویرائٹیز تھری ہنڈریڈ ٹو سیونٹی فائیو ٹو فور ہنڈریڈ گرام پر ہیکٹیئر اینڈ ایئرلی ویرائٹیز سکس ہنڈریڈ ٹو سیون ہنڈریڈ ففٹی گرام پر ہیکٹیئر فور پریپریشن آف لینڈ فار ٹرانسپلانٹنگ پریپیئر دا لینڈ ٹو اے فائن ٹیلتھ بائی ریپیٹیڈ بلاگنگ اینڈ ہیرونگس فالوڈ بائی لیبلنگ فائیو فرٹیلائزیشن کیویز گرو سیٹسفیکٹری اونلی وین دا سپلائی آف آرگینک نائٹروجن از اے لیبریل لیبریل فار بیسٹ ریزلٹ اپلائی ففٹی ٹو سکسٹی ٹن آف فارم ایڈ مینور پر ہیکٹیئر ایٹ دا ٹائم آف لینڈ پریپریشن سنس آف سپلائی آف فارم ایڈ مینور از ویری لمیٹیڈ ان دا ہلس اونلی ٹوینٹی فائیو ٹو تھرٹی ٹنس فارم ایڈ مینور پر ہیکٹیئر از یہ یوزلی اپلائڈ اپلائی ٹو ہنڈریڈ ٹو تھری ہنڈریڈ کے جی سپر فاسفیٹ اینڈ نائنٹی کے جی میوریٹ آف واٹاس بائی ڈریلنگ بائی آر بائی براڈ کاسٹنگ سفیسینٹلی بیفور ٹرانسپلانٹنگ آف سیڈلنگس ٹاپ ڈریس ٹو ڈوزیز آف سیونٹی فائیو ٹو ہنڈریڈ کے جی امونیم سلفیٹ ایٹ انٹروولس آف ٹو ٹو تھری ویکس آفٹر ٹرانسپلانٹنگ دا سیڈلنگ گیو اینودر ڈوز آف ٹو ہنڈریڈ ٹو ہنڈریڈ ٹوینٹی فائیو کے جی امونیم سلفیٹ ایز سرفیس اپلیکیشن ایٹ دا ٹائم آف سیڈ اسٹارک ایمرجنس ڈیورنگ مارچ ایکسٹرا اپلیکیشن آف نائٹروجن مے وی گیو ان ایز اینڈ وین دیر از نیڈ وی فار فلورنگ اسٹارٹس ڈپینڈنگ اپون دا کنڈیشنس آف دا کراپ وچ از دا گروور شوڈ وی ایبل ٹو جج سکس ٹرانسپلانٹنگ Three to four weeks old seedlings are transplanted. Transplanting should be preferably be done is a evening and the field irrigated immediately afterwards. Seven spacing, late varieties 60 multiply 60 cm, medium varieties 60 multiply 45 cm, yearly varieties 45 multiply 45 cm. At irrigation, cave is required a continuous supply of moisture irrigated the crop a frequently as required to have irrigation should be however a, be avoided when the heads have formed a sudden heavy irrigation after dry spell may causes bursting of heads. 9. Hoving and weeding At least 3 weedings and hovings till of end October are essential. One bedding and earthing up during November to December and second during March when seed stars have emerged. Control weeds and also help in proper drainage during winter and thereafter. 10. Staking After the flowering stalks are sufficiently developed, staking is necessary to keep the plants in a upright position. 11. Handling the mature heads after the planted crop has fully developed heads uh, at the close of atom. The next step is the handling of these parts of seed production. Handling of plants can be done by any one of the three methods. Stem, stem with central core intact or heads in intact methods. Described yearly, earlier. 12. 
insect pest and disease control control measures are same as described a cauliflower for cauliflower roging the first roging is done at the time of handling the mature heads all of types plants disease or otherwise undesirable type are removed at this step the second roging is done before the heads start bursting the loose leaved poorly headlings headings plants and those having a long stem and heavy forem must be rogued out at this stage it is highly undesirable to keep such poor plants in the seed plots subsequent roging for of types of disease plants affected by phloidy black leg black rot soft rot or leaf spot should be done from time to time as required harvesting and threshing cabbage starts seed stalks elongations from 20 sorry 10 to 20th march when the main temperature rises to 10 to 13 degrees celsius flowering and pod formation starts during the first week of april at mean temperature of 13 to 18.5 degrees celsius from 15th april to 15th may the crop is a full flux of flowering and fruiting the ripening of pods commences by 15th june to 20th june and the harvesting continues up to second week of july at mean temperatures below 20 degrees celsius during june to july and the maturity of crop is delayed at least by a fortnight and the harvesting may continue up to july end to avoid scattering of seeds the whole crop is harvested in two or three lots with skills skills generally the yearly plants are harvested first and when the pod color about the 70 percent of the rest of crops changes of the yellowish brown it is harvested completely and piles up for curing after 4 to 5 days it is turned upside down and allowed to cure for another 4 to 5 days in the same way it is then threshed with sticks and sifted with head sifters about thoroughly drying the seeds very are cleaned and stored seeded 500 to 600 and 50 kg per hectare thanks